This is another great home by Hanover Family Builders here at Hanover Lakes. Stay tuned and we're going to walk through this Wilshire gorgeous model home. like you could actually live in it. So Hi everybody, it's Amy with Heart & Home Orlando and today we are taking a look at the Wilshire floor plan. This is a model home here in Hanover Lakes out in St. Cloud. Florida. Now, did you get a look at the exterior elevation of this incredible home? There's some really adorable features and I want to point out one of them right now, which is look at your coach lights. Look at this. Now, this community is over 500 home sites, all of them nestled around the water. So if you like the lake life living, this community is definitely going to be one that you want to keep at the top of your radar. This is really a great community, great opportunity if you like that. So much so that we're going to talk about it when we go to the garage. That's right. Why are we going to talk about it in the garage? You just have to keep watching. All right. So this Wilshire floor plan, it's about 3,200 square feet. It's five bedrooms, has the option to have a sixth, but it has a really smart layout. So as soon as you've come in the front door over here, you've got your, your formal living room area. Basically it's a nice flex space here at the front of the home for you to do and utilize however you see fit. Now, if you were looking for design options, I'm in love with this. When the designer can create a way for a home to have a dynamic visual impact, but be realistically like function for you, that is just the biggest win, win, win. And this is definitely a big win. I love this. They've added these shelves, they've added the surround, but then they've added the wood, like wood back behind it the contrast between the brown wood and the white and the shelving is just spectacular. You have to come see this one in person, but that is absolutely stunning. Now here in this particular floor plan, the kitchen, dining area, and family room area are open and connected. Now take a look, even the pendant lights in here continue with the theme in this home and I really think it's spectacular. So in your kitchen, let's talk about your kitchen space. Well, first of all, you've got all of this space here and I love the two lighting fixtures. In one of my videos, I once talked about um, making sure that when you decorate your home, when you build your home, when you plan to build your home, don't forget about the lighting because that is really an important part. It's not just about the floor and the cabinets and the counter making sure that you have something visually appealing up is also really important and in this case look they've done two different lamp or lighting fixtures so that's something that if you were to build the home instead of having the one that probably comes standard you can ask to have two just like they did here in the model so you have a nice big island here in this kitchen you've also got plenty of cabinet and counter space if you're looking for design ideas take a look at the backsplash that they've done here so this is what I like about this home and the color scheme the color scheme is very neutral very calming and very warm that's really, really nice. Neutral, calming, and warm. It also means that you have a great palette, a great backdrop for you to have all of the different color accents that you want. In this case, they've chosen to accent with a really cool shade of green, and I love it. Okay, so kitchen area, now you've got your family room area. So not only do you have this family room area, but back behind me, it's really bright. You know why it's bright? Because it's the Sunshine State. It is Florida, and we are out here on the water. Take a look at this outdoor living space. That pool in this outdoor living area is absolutely amazing. So let's take a quick peek out here before we finish touring this first floor. Now this community is still relatively new. They are still finishing up the models. In fact, right next door, they're still working on the outdoor living space for the model home next door. But you can get a sense of how much this community is going to offer you. So this pool area itself, let's take a quick peek at it. You've got this gorgeous infinity pool. You've got your spa area here and it even has its own water feature there on the back side. It's really beautiful. You've got like looks like little fire pit type things, little um, right there where if you turn those on, you'll have a little bit of a glow. And of course, again, you're right here on the water itself. This is lovely sun shelf right here and then a ton of actual square footage 
for um, for actually you know sitting and reclining or getting some sun and then of course you've got your covered area here as well all of which also has a door over there to the side to connect you to the bathroom if you need to you know come in real quick to use the restroom okay so let's continue with the inside tour so here we are family room area now this particular floor plan has the master upstairs but it does offer you a bedroom and a full bath here on the first floor and that's something that's really important so if that is something on your list then let's check that off right now so you have a bedroom tucked over here in the back corner of the home and by the way what a bedroom it is again look at this so this is if you learn nothing from these videos and these amazing designers learn that you need to not forget and ignore your ceiling and those lighting fixtures because it makes the room that's fantastic so not only do you have this bedroom here but you've also got the full bath right here so bedroom and the full bath and so now we're gonna head out to the garage because this garage you have a three-car garage but one of the things that they're doing with um, in this particular community by the way you have a little drop zone right here kind of tucked away so as soon as you enter but take a look at this so you have um, you have your garage space You've also got this little niche area over here, but they actually have the option because this area is on the water. If you have a boat and you need the taller garage door, they actually have an option for you to have an eight foot garage door so that you can bring your boat in. There's a lot of things that this community is doing and a lot of choices that they're making intentionally because they know that if you want to move into this community, you are probably gonna love the lake life water living. All right, so we're gonna go upstairs and take a look at the other other one, two, three, four bedrooms that are upstairs. And wow, there's a game room you don't want to miss. I'll see you in just a second. Okay, so upstairs has four bedrooms, including the master and a really great fun zone that we're going to wait until the last minute to see. Okay, so first thing I want to point out is right at the top of the stairs, you have your laundry room. So first of all, if you're looking for design ideas, I love that they did this horizontal stripe all the way around. It's really cool. It kind of gives this room a little bit of a wow factor. You've got cabinet and counter space here, like a folding table here for the counters and still plenty of room for the washer and dryer. Now back over here in this direction, so you have three bedrooms back over there, but the master's over here. So the master, even though it's upstairs, it's still kind of private and tucked away up here toward the front of the home. So take a look at this space in here. Wow, this is a really large master, by the way. So I can even, because nothing is shoved to the wall here, except my mic. Okay, there we go. Um, we have all of this space right here. There's a ton of square footage here in this master bedroom. Take a look at the bathroom that's back behind you. So this is a fantastic layout for your master bathroom. You've got at the very end, right over here, you've got your privacy door for your toilet, but you have one magnificent closet right over here. Nice big closet space, a lot of room back in here, plenty of room for all of your clothes. It's really long. I don't know if you can see how long it is, but it's a really big closet. Now back over here, you have your his and her vanity. So you have two sinks, one giant mirror. You have lots of cabinet and counter space, linen closet, Closet. and then of course you've got your seamless shower over there to the side as well so what a great master bedroom but guess what we're not done it's not just the master that's upstairs there's three more bedrooms as well as that fun zone but don't peek at the fun zone when we go so don't look don't look avert your eyes avert your eyes don't look don't look don't look don't look okay we're gonna come over here now another thing okay so these designers they're so creative it just it drives me nuts that I can't be that creative so look at this wall right here so this is another wall okay as it's Stands, it's a wall but look what they've done they've created such a great visual piece and it will function they've used nothing more than than just wood to create all of this this is the wall back behind it and then you've got all of this trim here they've created kind of like cubbies with hooks to hang whatever it is that they want to hook but this is just really adorable it's a great 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 space now over here is a really large bathroom so this is nice and long two sinks privacy door here and then you have the linen closet tub with the shower and the toilet back over here so this bedroom is going to service those or this bathroom is going to service these three bedrooms and you have one two and three so let's go back and take a look at this one first okay so over here now we can't show you because it's mirrors and the cameraman doesn't like the mirrors but this little thing right here has these three great little pieces over here that has a little mirror medallion kind of in the middle and visually that's really great when you first turn the corner because you're like oh look at all that reflection so again well done okay this is 
such a cute bedroom. I love it. I'm really kind of sad that my kids are all growing up and I can't do something so sweet and cute. But look at this. They've created kind of a canopy tent type of effect. They've got the clouds. They've got little, I love that, like faux blinds that are going to come down on those two sections. They have, again, created so much interest with this trim work, the stars, just everything about this is adorable. But at its core, it's a bedroom. Because if you buy this home or you build this home, you have to kind of get creative yourself. But that's really awesome awesome. So back over here you have the second bedroom upstairs. Well, the third bedroom upstairs. We had the master and then we had that one and now we have this one. So if your kid's an angler, is that the right term? Angler? Remember, I'm a dancer. I'm a, like a sports enthusiast. So if you like to fish, this is an adorable, really, really cool design option for your room. Think about this. So they've added wood here. They've got the fishing poles mounted. They've got some great artwork. And look at this awning that they've kind of created here, like with a little tin roof. So clever. It is just so clever. So back over here, we have another bedroom. This one says dugout. So I'm going to guess softball. Yes, I'm right. Softball, baseball. I did it. Are you proud of me? Okay, so over here, we have another bedroom again super creative with just kind of you know just a lot of the elements that they do in here it's it's artistic and it functions and by the way that's a really cool fan while I'm looking at it all right so now these bedrooms just FYI these three bedrooms are along the back side of the home so all of them are gonna have windows it's gonna look out to that water all right so my favorite part of this house the way that they have designed this home so first of all when you think about this home don't get sidetracked by all of the design options. I mean, that's good, and we want that to motivate you, and we want you to steal some of those ideas. But at its core, I want you to think about the floor plan and how the floor plan functions and how much space it is. So this over here, oh my goodness. This, there's two areas, by the way. We'll look at that area back behind you in just a minute. But these are two spaces here for your game room, your flex space, whatever it is you need for your kids' playroom type area. But look at how this is designed, A plus, 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 plus. So first of all, this wall, is so adorable i can't stand it it's it's like connect four right so they've added pieces of trim they've got wood that they've painted and they've created the connect four effect and in this case it appears that yellow has one over here you've got these adorable x and o like little tables so cute but really remember think it's it's a game room the space is also what's amazing right Back over here, another great idea. So not only is this zone over here also large enough to continue to have the fun for like a pool table or a foosball table, you could create this to be a reading zone. Whatever it is that you want to do, this whole gigantic game room open and connected to one another gives you a lot of opportunity. But take a look at this. This is so smart. If you homeschool your children or if your kids are just book enthusiasts or if you're a board game enthusiast, take a look at this. This is great. The way that they have added this, um, I mean, you'd have to get someone who knows what they're doing, and that certainly would not be me, so please don't call me. But look at what they've done. It's a bookshelf, but they've done it at these diagonals, and then they've gotten really creative, and they've painted the inside of them randomly, and then they've inserted books, and they've inserted board games, and then over here you've got your chalkboard. I just am in love. I'm so sad that my kids are old, so maybe I need to have grandkids. I'm not sure. Anyway, okay, so Hanover Family Builders, you have done it again. This Wilshire floor plan is amazing absolutely amazing. The decorator has done a fantastic job, but more than anything, we need to talk about community and we need to talk about the builder itself and these floor plans and how versatile they are and how they are working so hard to give you options within the floor plan to make it work for you and your family. So if you are interested in this builder, in this community and learning more about what Hanover Lakes and Hanover Family Builders has to offer you, please give me a call. Remember, I do not represent the builder. My job, I'm a realtor, I'm gonna be a buyer agent for you to help get you connected to the people that can answer all of your questions and then let me help you through the process. Okay guys, call me at 407-848-8042. Thank you again for watching and um, I will see you next time. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hang out in this house for a little while if you don't mind. Have a great day everybody. Happy house hunting. This is another great home by Hanover Family Builders here at Hanover Lakes. Stay tuned and we're gonna walk through this Wilshire gorgeous model home.